joined with the LTP masters. We have Soul and Lara. Hey. Hello. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot to speak on the mic. How you doing, Biscuit? You good? I'm good, man. I'm good. How you doing? Very good. Okay. Tired. You. We here in Brighton, you know. Uh, Friday the festival. Very good. Very good. First edition. And uh, to, do, uh, to do a festival like anywhere else than, uh, than uh, the big cities, it's already hard and uh, so very well done and we're very proud of the organizers you know shout out b town yeah. latino so do you prefer doing more festivals in the uk or do you prefer traveling well for me guys, personally you guys go you're you're everywhere now uh, everywhere i don't know but um <laughs> <laughs> We're at, we're at some places, yes, we are at some places, but uh, it depends really. Me personally, I don't know about Lara, but she probably will tell you, but me personally, um, when we travel a lot, airport to airport, like constantly for like six weeks, eight weeks, it's nice to be home sometimes and do festival like in the UK, mm -hmm. just a drive, we get to the place, we do our work. And, Which I drive, by and, the way. And <laughs> she's the best driver Always in the world. And, and so sleeps, you know. Best driver in the yeah. world. I, I'm, so, I'm, I'm, so, I'm, I'm, I'm so safe. I'm so safe that I sleep. Um, but, uh, yeah, and, uh, and uh, it's also very important, you know, uh, being... Like going to, uh, to other countries and having exposures is very, very good. But it's also very important to us to to keep faces here in the UK. So, mm -hmm. you know, so we can also keep whatever following that we have here or even grow it. It's more important to us here in the country, in the UK, where we, the country that we represent, yeah, yeah. than elsewhere in the world, basically. Yeah. yeah. So, all right, let's, let's, let's start from the beginning. Yeah. Oh, wow. oh okay. God. okay. Dave. So, all right. So, like, how did you, how did you, how did you start? dancing for a start because hmm. like dancing so? together you mean or dancing in general dancing in general like okay getting into latin dance how did that how did that come about okay i think okay for me it started maybe 10 10 11 years ago okay and then oh, wow. i didn't know nothing so i came from like a contemporary background and then uh, i had a salsa teacher i was doing an acrobatics class and there was a latin teacher afterwards and then he asked me one day, oh, you should stay and try it. And I tried it, and then from there I started. Then there was like free socials in Nottingham, where then I met Saul, and then it just went from there. <laughs> to, oh, make, so you met him? to make this story very short, because it's a very oh, long story. Oh, it's a very long story. Wow. It sounds like you missed out quite a bit. Yeah. <laughs> <Very>. <laughs> she, went, she, went, she, went, she went from season one to the, season, to the season final, you know, the, the finale, you know, like... <laughs> Yeah. Missed out all the juicy stuff. She, the she won pilot season fin for finale, you know, like straight away. Um, no, wait. So, so basically, did you start with salsa, right? Yeah, I no, I started with um, kizomba actually. Okay. I did okay. kizomba, then salsa, then bachata was the last one. I never used to like bachata actually, and wow. I didn't. I made her love bachata. Yeah, I never used to connect with <laughs> bachata, the music and everything. But then yeah. I met Sol and everything, and then with time, then he made me fall in love with bachata. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right so so then you for you okay uh, how did you start what was the, okay okay um so basically i started with um i was actually never a dancer like my early 20s yes i'm i'm deep into my 30s people um in my early 20s uh i was just i uh, just like clubbing and everything and my my brother tomba who some of you may know. Um, I think everyone knows. Uh, <laughs> took me, took me clubbing. She was showing me a few, few hip hop moves and stuff, and then, uh, and then I really started growing a passion for 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 moving my body. I, I, I didn't know that my body could do all this stuff. So uh, I took some hip hop classes here and there, and I uh, took my hip hop very, very seriously. Uh, and then Tomba, that same Tomba again, you know, went from hip hop. And started to do salsa. I think, I think it was like back in 2007, 2008 or something. Mm -hmm. And he was like, "Oh, come, 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 come! You know, like let me show you salsa is amazing." I said, "Come on, it's for old people. Leave me alone with your salsa thing." You know. Mm -hmm. But then, yeah, no, we. Um, uh, I went once, and uh, I loved it. Absolutely loved it, and I love how people like interact with each other and everything. So I started taking classes and everything. But it took me it took me six months to get like the basic of 
the basic of salsa, basic steps right. It was horrible. I wasn't made for it. But uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, so so it just it just started like that bit by bit. And uh, I remember even like dancing merengue just to build up my confidence. Yeah. You know, like you know, because merengue is just like tap tap tap. Yeah. And, <laughs> No, just to build up my confidence. Yeah, don't tell Dominicans that. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. But <laughs> the way that we're doing it here, you know, like and yeah. and um and uh, and that was when that was when I heard Aventura play. That was back in 2008. Oh, wow. the, the DJ played Aven once one track of Aventura. I don't remember which one it was, uh, but. And I was like, I said to my brother, I was like, oh, I like this salsa. He said, no, that's not salsa, that's bachata. <laughs> I was like, what's the difference? I said, one is salsa, one is bachata. Yeah. I said, okay, I'm not going to get an answer for you. So I went to Wikipedia, you know, like, and I started, oh, really? yeah. And I started, like, researching and everything. And um, I came across Aventura again. Mm. And from there, I was listening to the song. I was listening to the lyrics. I was actually, um, I was actually translating the lyrics into English and, mm. It actually meant something, and I like how it was dance and everything, and boom, from there, 2008, no turning back. Bachata was my number one love. I never turned my back on Bachata. Bachata never turned his back. Wow! Wow! Bachata's life. Bachata is life. <laughs> and, got uh, the sound bites. It's already loaded them up. Bachata puts food on our table. Bachata puts food on my table. Oh, what the